what I wanted to. Hey, <laughs> cause I decided to do. <laughs> Alright, so right now, I'm at my homie Lee's tattoo shop. I'm about to get tatted up with force before we do that. He is doing an art extravaganza tomorrow. And basically I brought him all of these skateboards to paint on. Petersburg. Hey, can you, can you could you film just this part? Yeah. So it's already it's already recorded, so just film yeah, us. At the Petersburg Art League. Still not full is the name of the show. There's gonna be a bunch of bands, a bunch of artwork going down. I'm gonna be teaching a whole bunch of kids for free how to be free with paint for free. So come on down to the Petersburg Art League. I don't know the exact address, but if you go on Facebook and just put in still not fooling with no G on the end, you'll find the event. And if you're in the Petersburg area, feel free to come on out because we're gonna be sitting there and having a good time, painting all kinds of stuff. Lane has donated a ton of old skateboards that we're gonna be painting on as well. Uh, lots of art supplies. There's also going to be face painting, live bands playing inside and out. Uh, just a good time, free, and it's all for charity. There's no cost to get in. It's a free event. Everything's free. All donations go directly to a place called the James House. And the James House provides protection and security for extremely abused children and sexually molested children. So it's a really good organization to come out and support. Hell yeah. That's how we do it. Product. All right. All right, let's move. Can you thank Lane oh, for being no. the biggest donator yeah, of supplies to this thus far? I have gone through a lot of skateboards in my lifetime, and I'm glad I can pass them on to keep going on. <laughs> Yes, yes. These kids are to begin with. Yep, that's it. To have a, a hand custom painted skateboard by themselves. That's, that's another thing. Yeah. The art also teaches them about skateboard. It's all exactly. I mean, it's, it's all, all intertwined. Good. Oh yeah, yeah. Thank you. Well, I like to say you can keep it true to the streets on four wheels. Oh, yeah. Art with art. Keep it true to the streets. Oh, yeah. Canadian Maple, 1996. Hey, a subplot. Woo! Yeah, this baby ain't broke yet. And you know what? The wheels roll like butter. Come on, baby. <laughs> now you go, go ahead. That's how we keep it true to the streets Sorry. right there. Hey, stay grinding. All day. Stay grinding in these streets. Legally or illegally. Okay. No name drops. What, was that a Lupe fiasco name drop? I told you yeah. the name drops. I, I, mean, I give it up to Lupe. Lupe put, put like skateboard on the map for everybody. I give him that. About that kick, that kick push pass. Ah, that That's kick, the only thing that ain't kick push pass right the there. Wheels. These are some <laughs> sick ass wheels. Let me show you. I'll show you the wheels I just got.
Here you go, Lane. Check these out. It's almost saved Jake's. Oh, good old rat bone. These are going to be my new filming wheels. So you can get them. And look at this board, man. Smooth ride. You don't got to get them down or nothing like that. This is so ancient. They, uh, if it had a nail, a nose, or a tail, it was going a long time ago. <laughs> plenty of fog going through that thing. Oh, yeah. I saw someone do a, an ollie off the top of a picnic table just the other day. Come down on it from five feet down. And, hey, dude, Elvin. Hey, Elvin. Uh, -uh that thing's old. Ain't no made in China. <laughs> Are y'all ready? Lane is the man. Guess what's have, up? You gotta, you gotta have the bowlers wheels on there to hit the bowlers. Hey kids, don't forget to wear your, wear your helmets. Helmet, and you can even pay those to make up your own too. Don't smoke cigarettes for bad for you. Severely. <laughs> they, they are. Uh, uh, they are. <laughs> Way to call me out, Steven. Uh, All right, somebody else thing. take this room. Gotta run, bro. I got all the time in the world. I'm off work, it's Friday. Great chill. Hey. Doing the filming session. I'm taking close care of you right here. Um Hey Spot up. I may just leave my hat and my sunglasses on. So, give me a favor, can you film me opening the box and I'll just take I'll just sit this like right here. Oh, yeah. Whatever. There we go. <laughs> well, yeah, I might be in town, so I'll, I might come check that the spot out tomorrow. I don't think I'm going to go back. We're meeting up in the morning after me and my dad and my son go out for some food. Uh, we're going to meet and head there. So it comes to All nice help is welcome. Anyone's welcome. Well, I'll definitely be down there. The only people that ain't going to be welcome, well, they'll show themselves out of store real easy on their own. Because there ain't going to be nothing but positivity growing. What do we go with this? Something's all nice. It's a pretty good tripod. Very sturdy. You can't beat 62 inches. That's what she said. We ain't even gonna wrap today. Y'all can. I might say something here and there, but I hold it all in. I don't know if I know that out no more. Not until I'm ready to get the teeth out of the face. Did I say something? I don't think so. We always do success. Read my face. <laughs> <laughs> and then retrace. I want you to come. Right. You see that camera? Yo, what's up? Thank you for watching. Who is to be in charge? Please give me a like. We're about to do, um... Oh, what's up, dude? You're the dude from the Netherlands, right? Um, yeah, we're about to do a tattoo live. Thank you for watching. Share the video if you if you do it, how you been. So, that's going to be very cool. We got somebody from the Netherlands. Hey, do you so, like uh, Nordic death metal? Nordic black metal. Do you like Nordic metal? You like Nordic black metal? 
You gotta, you gotta talk to him, bro. Ah. Uh, this, this is the tattoo band right here. Oh, we're just artists. Uh, I'm being told to talk to you about. <laughs> How do you have so Too many subs? Time. I just been putting out mad. Vi- I, I just been trying to put out videos consistently and trying to get my content. I can play stuff out loud. Like you gotta yeah. put a bud in my ear. Yeah, I just been trying to like. I I've just been focusing on trying to put out videos like every single day, um, consistently, and just have a versatile selection of content. Falling, oh. laying, rolling. You hold this. Oh, are you We're all online? linking it up. It already is. Just go follow. Okay, I tell you, I'm almost at a thousand. I'm almost at a thousand. Look up uh, Free Space on Facebook. Oh yeah, check out Free Space on Facebook. Um, check out Lee Odom on Instagram. And what's your uh, other Instagram? Art period. Spell the word out. Period. Because computers won't accept the dot. So art period LLC paintings. I know there's a lot, but it really is the name of my company, and that's my son's name. Look like a little bit of everything. Yeah, a little bit of everything. Y'all check it out. A little bit of everything. That's what it all boils down to. Your hands take care of it. You gotta develop the idea to a cohesive vision that has longevity. First, it has to be viable. Gotta be proactive as well. Get after it. You gotta be a go getter. Oh man, y'all just want me to play Vader again. Time's a waste. I'm gonna have to put it in my ear though. Oh no, that's their favorite word, go. They just say it very loudly. Check out the 360 camera out. Hey, Lane. Yeah. Let me start looking at your chest. Why are you finishing this up? So we're working on my chest and my arm. Uh huh. I thought I was working on the chest. What are we working on? I thought we were going to go. I thought we were going to go. What do you want me to read? No, I, I, I. Oh, you want me to redo that for you? Okay, so do you want me to just uh, give the contrast, the pop, the colors? What do you want? Whatever you want. Because I, I had envisioned what I was seeing was clouds and sun rays shooting across your chest from down here in this corner where we left off. Wait, well, let's just do that. Whatever, um, whatever you had in your I mean, head. Whatever. I also have seen something else landing right here. Well, that ain't there yet. Well, I kind of wanted. Well, I don't know if this is. I wanted uh, a So I don't know what is there because I. I volleyball? So, I mean, <laughs> well, the only reason I was thinking there, volleyball is. There's a space there. That Wilson! Is there. Yeah, there's some, there's some street, I think but there is. There is. Well, I kind of wanted a volleyball there because my daughter loves volleyball, okay. and that's over her name. So that's the only thing I can think of. But. Okay. We'll think about that one for a second. I got to think about that one for a second. Basically. Is this chair going to be here or whatever it is? We can go in on this repair. Why not? Without the br- darkest spots and the brightest spots, you ain't gonna see the colors anyway. The artwork. So, that's kind of where we. Yeah. If you want color, give me, point me in a, tell me in your favorite color. 
My favorite color is red. Red? Okay. So you like red? You like green? Yeah, the yellow green. Bro. The reason I said that is because it's a compliment. I really like all. I like all colors. Bro. All right. Well, we don't want to put a rainbow. But uh, yeah, I'm not trying to be Takashi Six Nine. Don't worry. Wherever we put a color, there will be a compliment. Uh, yeah. We have a look. Yellow and blue, red, right? green, that's easy. Y'all ever see that commercial? Well, that's impossible. I can't count the number of students I ask what yellow and blue make, and they tell me purple. I'm like, I got to go. Yeah, see where they zip the bag up. Then I asked another student the same thing. I was like, did y'all ever take an art class? Like, this is like a glass zip like commercial. <laughs> Uh, we're coming here. Yeah, sure. Let's see. Oh, what you doing? I think we're going to go the right drop. Right. 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 Oh, shit. Yeah. So, how dark red do you want to go? I can go anywhere from like a... I don't use anything darker than dark red because if you do, it's just going to come up looking pink. So I'll use a dark red, a crimson red, and then a burnt red that I mix myself. That sounds dope. Burnt red is, is deep and rich. Yeah, so it, it will pop a little bit more, is what you're saying. Mm, maybe we'll use both. Or I'll blend it out with white. But we're going to start with black. And I use a lot of white for blending. I'm not just gonna put solid red in here or solid green. That would just be kind of like flat. So anywhere we decided the colors, we're gonna go from the darkest tone of that color all the way through the brightest point. And that's what's gonna make you see the picture is there's dark spots I put in first and there's brightest spots I put in last. Everything else would be a blend in the color. This ain't gonna work, then we got the table. Okay. You can get the comfy chair. I just want to make sure that the environment's stable. The work environment. That's the, not that stable. Because you can just have your arms straight back like that, I can get right at it. Uh, I can do it like this too. Let's open the table. Uh, I'm going to take this bag out and go to the bathroom. How you do that? I may have to move something. Yeah. But really good at that. Honestly, we just opened up a lot of space. It seems like we were looking more space, but not really. Lane, that's on the back of your right side. Yeah, it's pretty close up to her. Okay. You hear me? All right, y'all ready? Yeah. So it's, okay. you hear me? You ready? Say, right? Woo. All right. Hey, everything's filming still, so you think it's still up? Yeah, these dots, I don't feel good anymore. Well, I gotta get it. Quick smoke break, you know what I'm saying? Bright out here, the shades on. Shut this door. I hear burn up. You see it? It's life. 
Shred, bro. Get to CSX out here. So many good shows. So many good shows. Golf Face. Golf Face. RVA. One man band legend. Beautiful Richmond. Ah, that's funny. Back at you. I 
would suggest you check out Excision if you haven't already. Check out X. Check out what he's doing with Tech 9. And realize that they are barely moving. It's just like your heart beat. Uh, back out. Go for boy. Go for this. Go for that. Go for this. Go for that. Go for. At his finest. Right there. Living the dream. <laughs> Here you go, man. Get cancer while you're at it. Shut up. You're gonna, love, you go, you're gonna be the one shutting up, keep smoking them cigarettes, and gonna be able to breathe or talk. Look at you. you Already you to the point. They're gonna ask me for a lighter. We, I don't smoke. I don't be, smoke cigarettes. We're gonna be the old folks home together. We're tricky. Take this. My name's Bennett. Now you with it. Man, and, and, and he's a thief. And he's a thief. He got nasal problems. Smoked Yo, cigarettes. I did this and he's a lighter I thief. This dude's and laundry. a lighter thief. Y'all see this man? That's your boy. Me. Allergies are messed up right now. Yup. That's exactly what it is. Allergies. I don't know why you would do that. Hawaii. Allergies from Hawaii. See? Hawaii. Still got the CSX roll the bar. All the coal. Oh, Here you go. You about the Uber? Where? You're not gonna kick it. I'm about to tell you where to go do that in a second. Alright. I don't know why you're gonna Uber out. Thought you were supposed to be sitting here I did my fuck. I folded your clothes. What more do you want for me? But I'm so ready to get this artwork done. Animal bus, some other stuff. Good. What are we talking about, that? CSX. What's CSX? Right there. Move that coal. So I think of the peak up there, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, they slower than molasses. Aren't they? That's that cold, that's that natural burn. Even normal speed, man, we flow four times faster squared. How the heck? I know. Right? What do you think about? I ain't even gonna say nothing else. I'm holding it in. What do, what do you think about flat earth? I think I'm gonna kick their teeth in. Till then, y'all can just read my face. I definitely want to kick somebody's teeth in myself. Straight up American History X. Fight the fucking curve. Natural elegance. Oh no. Whatever, I'm just here for the ride. I'm gopher. Go for this, go for that, go for this, go for that. You know? It just is what it is. Gopher. Y'all wanna check out the traffic? 
Here's the traffic. I don't know what to say. I'm not really a YouTube live kind of guy. I don't have my own page. I just shred, drink paps, and go to work. That's how I live my life. Hawaii, that's what I was saying. Yeah. My dad was born. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, Her yeah, we decided to use one. Hiroshima. Nagasaki. Yeah, yeah. What? What he's talking about. Oh, yeah. We did, we did, right, we did now, dirty on that. What you want to do is flip around completely on your stomach. Can I get it? Can I get it? Paper tunnel? Yeah, whatever you want. I want you to be comfortable. Like we don't, we're just gonna get okay. that. Because what you gave me to work with at this point, well, the tunnel material for tomorrow, which is great, I was envisioning your chest. It's not gonna do me any harm to have already envisioned, you know, elaborate as I develop the idea further. Like, is it? No. Well, I mean, we're we gonna take do, care of this. We can do my chest though. If you want uh, to I want to do this now. Okay. I want what you want. Because I just thought we had discussed, like last time, I thought we were good at it. We did. Let I just, rest. I had seen something in my head for your chest already, but I didn't know what was going on to the top pack. And I think that, uh, was that volleyball or soccer ball? Well, yeah, what is a volleyball? Volleyball. Yo, switch your arm back, lady. There somewhere, but. Right there. And it's kind of like a circle, right? Yeah. Let's give it some wings. Right there. Right, that that's what's be that's the before, yeah. right there. Let's give it some wings. So as a circle, that's right. Because that's like my daughter's first love. You know how to read that? That's what she does. Let's give it some wings. And she's like really good. So you know what I mean? Oh, good yes. fly. You didn't tell me that, did you? I ain't know that. I don't know nothing. I also was a, a symbol for the soul. Exactly. I like I like the idea. I definitely want to do the clouds uh, with the sun rays and stuff too. Oh yeah, well that's come shooting through from the other direction, cutting through everyone, connection everything. I might need another uh, yeah. And that might sound weird or whatnot, but it's really just a picture on my chest is crazy. I thought it was weirder than virtual reality machine too that they had all this light shooting everywhere. I asked, I was like, what are these lights for anyway? Cause like, isn't it running from a cable on a computer to like some goggles and some headphones? It's, it's like, what, what are all the lights for? Like, oh, that's just for show. <laughs> like, that's what I thought. <laughs> Is that gonna fuck you up? No, that's actually that's good. Cool. good. That's perfect. No, that's, that's perfect. Perfection. Hey, Trick. Let's, uh. What do we want to watch? Why don't. Hey, Trey, why don't you pick? Yeah, you pick. If you don't know, just go to search if you, uh, well that's through Amazon. You can search through Amazon. If it says Prime beside it, then we got it. Uh, Netflix, you can search through anything in there.
But yeah, I mean, anything's clever. I love kids' movies. I wish they wouldn't have taken Zootopia off of, uh... I fucking love that movie. I know, it's so good. Well, now that one of my favorite movies is fucking Trolls. Railing? Yes, dude. That's Rolling. Oh, yeah, that's Lane Rolling, by the way. <laughs> and we're about to be rolling. About to be. We already saw rolling. rolling decades ago. <laughs> And that, what was Rolling, I doing? Rolling too. <laughs> Those were <laughs> <are> good old. <laughs> good fucking times, dude. Yeah, good times, yeah. no doubt. Nah, that lane used to skate a half pipe in the back of my first shop. Oh, yeah? Yeah. That's the dog. Yeah. He pops fucking up out of nowhere. I ain't seen him in like 15 years. And he's like, shows up and starts shooting documentaries. I'm like, he, he'd be like, like that. Dude, I'm like... On a whole like, other level. Well, that's how, like, well... I made a company that can grow in any direction. That's how you... Yeah. The only service is one. Art. So you gotta be versatile. It's only one service. This is one service. I chose to do this and sacrifice everything else so I had a child to take care of and I needed money immediately. immediately. Can, can I use this? this I'm a painter in all actuality. And beyond that, I'm a performer. There you go. You gotta now be versatile. I, I compose. Here we go, guys. Paid. Paid in pleasure. Alright, you see this? Let's get this little bit of Got whatever it. somebody did, oh, whatever, yeah. okay? Yeah. He's All about right. to make it. Got the front row. He's, got, he's about to Picasso it. Y'all ready to bring this thing to life? One needle, no liner. 13 mag. We use everything, same machine, same needle, for everything. And I'll probably use my sunglasses too, that price a little light. Did I say that bright's a little light? Oh. <laughs> I think y'all got the picture right. Perfect. Hey, Trey, yeah. could you grab me a fresh box of gloves, please? Yeah. Yeah. Let me see, let me see this real quick. I got it. I need to, um, uh, I need to share this. Then I go to here, share. Is this, okay. is this what? Right. If I used an eight round, Need a blast. Hey, Trey. Sorry, I'll do it. Ooh, that's you go for you. Get the screamer. And uh, put the eight in it. I put them on the switch. Everything. They just flick right over. Yeah, I don't use numbers. Flick right over. They got 10 turn dials, each got 100 settings of the toggle switch. There's 200 settings, two different frequencies, uh, two different machines, two different style machines. All you gotta do is hit the switch. Yeah, and That's I tune it to my ear. That's why I leave one ear open and the other one playing. Nice. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's gonna want some uh, work at some point, too. Thank you, Trey. What was, was, was that point that you were you? I don't know. I don't think you have to Right there. Just 
can't kill I just can't kill her. She's just too strong. Not without my hammer. Yeah, Are you the god of hands? So what? That's his plan right now. Final reciting. Oh yeah, uh Stevens wants to get some work too. So not like today, but he definitely would like to come to you. Sure, we can make arrangements. I'm gonna be coming to you uh, very shortly. Will you, if you bring it art, you and art have a place to stay? I know. I've already spoken to him about. It. And I appreciate that. Hopefully, it's hopefully, likewise. Hopefully, my daughter will be up that weekend too. Cause it'll be pretty cool. Oh like, yeah, he, like the same age. Yeah, he's he's such a sweet boy. To say he's got somebody to play with. He's just a little slow to warm up. That's just him. You give him five minutes, he'll be your best friend. Yeah, then we can go hit up all the museums. No, I tell you the truth, though, the first thing you gotta do is tell you to fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> I respect that, though. But he ain't gonna like, say it, you just gonna know it. <laughs> that's, how, that's how my daughter's doing, too, though. It's, it, it's a good trait to It have. is a good trait, especially nowadays. Yeah, no doubt. Are. Yeah, some, some wild you people out a, there. You got a gay butt trust. I, I, Art makes the final decision when I make a decision. I trust the child instinct. Look at the cute little baby picture right there. Oh, uh, see. I mean, it just couldn't get better. Someone from Norway turned down. I listen to some Norwegian metal. We got Norwegian myths playing over there. How old are you? Um. Art, he's going on 11. It's my son's name, Art. A R T Lee L E I G H. Odom, O D O M. I'm Lee Odom. He's Art. This is Art, period. So if y'all ain't down with that, y'all need to move. I'm talking to you about you and your situation. Take care of your kids, even if you have to sacrifice. Do it right. Exactly. This is all about This is dead. This is dead. Just like just getting a fresh one. <laughs> what we do is use that layer for cleaner. It's all good. We just redirect it. Mm-hmm. Well, it's hit the floor. That means it's dead as far as me wiping off lane, but as far as scrubbing the floor with bleach and matticide later, it's... Did we get that set up? Sweet. Let's rock and roll. Oh yeah, um, so Lee, um, what, what you should do now is just let the audience know exactly, like, if you will, what, what needle you're using now and why you're using Oh, well, it. I mean, I was using a 13 mag to do everything, um, which I could continue to do, but to do this more efficiently, I don't mind wasting supplies. You know, I, I got two kingpin set up for two kingpin needles to do something I could do with one needle and one machine. If I have to set up a third or a fourth, well, that's what I would do. Because they're all disposable. It's just trash anyway. Uh, disposable, uh... Sterile. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's like... I, I guess I'll go into this again if y'all ain't watched the first video. Do I really need to put clear plastic around this when it's already plastic? <laughs> 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 
sure. <laughs> True. I mean, do I need to go out any further? Yeah. I don't think I need to go out any further. All right, on that note, we're going to hit a title switch. Now we have an electromagnetic machine that's had a spring cut back in half to make it run twice as fast. The space cut in half to make it run four times as fast. And this sucker has a little bite to it. But it's made to. The reason I got it out is because we got these little little thin lines get ready for the bite. edge of the 13. But the these bite. areas I can get quick style with this eight. Yeah, no doubt, Southern Odyssey. I got you, bro. Oh, yeah. Definitely. <laughs> Appreciate it. <laughs> Absolutely hit that like button, please. Mm -hmm. He said hit that like button, please. And, and good, to, good to hear from you, Southern. Oh, thank you. Oh yeah, my Facebook page too, my tattoo page on Facebook. I actually, I hit the like all thing like a while back. I was inviting like 100 people a day or whatnot. He got to like 400 or something and I was like, man, it's, it's giving me the option to hit uh, select all to send likes. I did that jump and now it won't let me invite nobody. What? I don't know if I broke a rule or I don't know what I did, but my computer said if I click this, that it would send an invite to everybody, and I got over 3,000 contacts. Just on my personal page, so I'm like, all right, let's do that. No, we'll but it didn't invite nobody, but now it won't let me invite anybody. So, if you go to look up Lee Odom, L-E-I-G-H-O-D-O-M, look for the picture of the little kid. Actually, it probably have a picture of me with a tattoo, but on the front page, it'll have me with a little kid drawing pictures. That's my son. Definitely look up Lee Odom tattoos and hit like. Yeah. Uh, Facebook hit that, hit that Lee Odom tattoos and then, and then arch, hit like. Arch space too. That's right. Free space. Yeah, free space. Free, free space. space. Free space. You can post whatever free space. you want. Post whatever you want. It's all free. Go go hit that like. Now just remember though, that I ain't even created. I just asked someone to. I just administrate it. So, post whatever you like, but be proper. Don't be posting a bunch of junk on there. Don't be advertising your company. or This is for music and art. And being free. Not for pornography. No dick pics. <laughs> you can boobies, baby. Painted boobies. So that's all, that's all. Oh, that you're free, man. You can post whatever you want, whatever type of music you like, whatever type of artwork you like. If you want to make some artwork just to put on that? That's cool. That's why it's called free space. It's been gaining popularity pretty quickly. Since we shout everybody out, go listen. check out uh, Pissing Contest. It's a local punk rock band, really good peoples. Go check them out. Oh man, you know what I tell them? Hey man, I'm going to urinate, and guess what? You're in it. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> now, now the go go check out check out Golf Face. Oh, that was my joke from like 20 years ago. Good local music. I just had to put a little positive spin on the name a little bit. Make them laugh. I'm trying to make sure I get it good. People think they ain't, think they ain't too serious. In front of the, front of the, the camera. Oh yeah. Sweet. I'm gonna do all this with this eight. I'm gonna thicken those little spider lines. Come back with the 13. Do our color blends. Way faster. Way more efficient. Thank you, Trey. Oh, crap.
I don't know if y'all, did y'all meet Trey? Yeah, I think they met him last time. Let's meet Trey again. Yo, what up, Trey? Trey Brown, he's new assistant. Trey's been my only assistant. I do believe he's the only one that's gonna pass the test. See, he's my 10th apprentice. You got the title wise. 10th apprentice, ain't none of them make it. Cause after they were done learning, the basics, they basically have to tattoo me so that I can correct any fundamental mistakes before they create their own. Then they gotta tattoo themselves and do it correctly. And the reason they have to tattoo themselves is that they'll know what they're doing to somebody else. How are you gonna know what you're doing to somebody else unless it happens to be done? Hey, so what up? Oh, what's up? What's going on, everybody? Um, what y'all going off with? But he's YouTube. there, man. He really is. He uh, started tattooing me the other day. We were out of town. So we only got the first little bit done, but he did those lines perfect on the first try. Just the like it's supposed to be done. He let the machine work. He ain't trying to work the machine. Come on. It's going up and down for a reason. Work smarter, not harder. I mean, come on, y'all. Light in. What are y'all talking about? Do you know how to run a machine or do you not know how to run a machine? Don't blame it on, oh, he was light-handed or he was hit. What are you talking about? You mean you picked at it and you put a bunch of gunk all over it and you ripped out your own tattoo? Or was the guy actually pushing down and scarring you? If he was pushing down and scarring you, you should have got up and ran because you would have seen blood. <laughs> Do you see any blood? Yeah, I can't. Do you see any me. blood? You should not see blood while you're tattooing. You oh. might see a little bit of plasma when you start working with your lighter colors, which is just uh, a milkyish yellow to red. But that's not real blood. Real blood is deep, what dark, about drink thick. So it's like purple. With drinking big blood come out? And his blood is too much love. See, we're only putting, going to the second layer of the skin. You go through the epidermis to the dermis. That's where you paint on a living organism. You go deeper than that, you're starting to hit the subcutters or the hypodermis. That's where the sweat glands are and the fatty tissues begin. That's how people get blowouts. You know, when you see a line and it's blurring out somewhere. Um, that's how people get scarred. Now, I don't take before and after uh, pictures, but I've told people for years that I specialize in large-scale custom tattoos, cover-ups, and repairs. And I'm usually doing all three at the same time. So that's just the nature of it nowadays. Um, he buys. <laughs> I bet you because It's horrendous. Yeah. <laughs> horrendous, <laughs> ain't it? And see, I'm moving yeah. super, super, duper yeah. slow. Come on, arm off. Super slow talking, y'all, the whole time. And I'm almost done <clears throat> with all the black work. He was finished on that? <laughs> yeah, he would. He oh, was, yeah, he was finished. He's been needles a couple times. Too. Who did that tattoo? Carter. Hey, Jay I Carter. Do I do? Alfonso. Alfonso. <laughs> Alfonso. <laughs> Jonathan. Oh, I can tell that he. Because uh, uh, he always does like. He's always like off. Like. I don't know. He never like puts in 100% on nothing. What I do. Yeah, man, you always got to put in 100% and then 100% on top of that 100%, man. Yeah. I was 100% like, sure, sure he was done. <laughs> go all yeah. in. All yeah, in. That's it. That shit hurt? I go all it? in with nothing in my that's hand and take it off. Really to hurt like yeah, that. it was terrible. But they're going through it's like simple. the third layer of skin. That's what they He's just telling a little. Up. Like this tattoo right here. A little, a little, a little. A little. Did you, did you, did you still then you say, all right. Yeah, it's tough. It's 
but yeah. Yeah. fold, 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 like fold. You ain't got to show them your hand because they all folded. Just, look how dark it is. I got that shit without They don't want nothing in the hand. He just was sucky at letters, really. Why do you gotta get this, that shit fixed too? What's that? This one right here. I okay, guess. so that's some really bad old English. Yep, I really need to get that fixed. Why don't we just cover it? Yeah. That's, what I, that's definitely what I want to do. Uh, that's what I want to do with my own. Up there, man. Just cover it. <laughs> I mean, straight up, I mean, you can cover anything. Hey, you you know, ready? How you gonna cover that? With a lot of imagination and <laughs> <laughs> I've done worse. I had someone, it looked like they stuck their arm up an elephant's uh, butt. It's bad. Yeah. You know what I did? I started, I darkened the black areas as I started pumping white patterns into the black places. Yeah. And you're like, how do you do that? I'm like, well. How do you do that over there? <laughs> Flip it real quick. Just show them some geometric shape. Yeah, I, I hit it with that earlier. look over here real fast. Alright, do we need to answer anymore? Is that, is, is that camera still rolling, Steve? Yeah. Cool. I've been trying to keep my arm out the middle Y'all of it. Y'all stay tuned in because it's about to go down tomorrow. A lot of stuff happened recently. Well, I want to come to it so I can film it. So do I. I want you there. there. So I'm, I'm gonna... You trying to go see it? I got, I got stuff. I got to do it already. You can ride, man. Uh, I'm definitely going to do it. All you have to do is meet me at my house. <clears throat> Ray's going to meet me there. We're good. This what time do you want to fish it, man? That's uh, tomorrow night. Uh, so you're you're making me laugh. I can go do that and come back and beat up with you. Right? I was just having a flash of like UHF, the movie. Hey, Lane. Yeah. This, I normally do this, but we just started rolling. Let's do it how I do it now. The reason I do it is not because of you, because I sterilized this table twice while you were doing whatever. Um, and yesterday. Um, help keep the table clean. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> I don't use saran wrap or any of that mess. I choose to go a little step further and use dental bits for everything. You notice I'm using three right now. I'll end up using four or five by the time we're done. you got plastic on one side, paper on another. That way if something makes it through the plastic, you just absorb by the paper. There you go. If you just put plastic on someone, it's just going to create a mess. And plus the sun can see right through it. Uh, and magnify it. Yeah. Through patrol, you know, a great thing for your fresh tattoo, right? They're using their brains, right, Trey? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> do you think most tattoo people just do it because it's like that's what they think? No, nah, well, just well, they either think that's what it is or they're just being cheap. Yeah. Because I understand having the budget. That don't mean you cut corners. What do you feel about the people that come in there and take the tattoo off, like the... They take it off? Like flash, you know, flash art. Like, you know when they got, like, the... Oh. They just pick a picture. I don't know. Like I, I call them they should be shut down. Yeah, that's what I was... I was ah, like, that, that's... that's flash uh, art. Well, they, they, you know what's worse than someone tattooing out of their kitchen? A street shop. Yeah. Go to a street shop. I guarantee you under my chair. Paying four times as much as what you should have paid, only a quarter of to begin yeah, with. Because yeah. I never, like, that was never my scene, like, to go and pick something out of those, like, picture album books. You know what I mean? They got, like, all the pictures of, like, tattoos that probably, like, a hundred people have. Yeah, flash tattoos. Yeah. Hey, Lane, flash. you know how it helped uh, Darren start Ink? Remember that? Yeah. Well, I helped him start two other shops after that. One was called Zephyr. Oh, I was good for that. Yeah, Zephyr was a, you know, named after the first skateboarding team. Tony Hawk started. Yeah, Zephyr. Zephyr. Zephyr Street. Late 70s. 
a little zephyr tattoo. Then I went out on my own, started Heart and Soul. Left there, went further out on my own, started my own art studio on Main Street. Then Darren came back begging me to help him start Monkey Brains. He said, I won't take much from you because I know it's all your clients anyway. Change my technique slightly if you had noticed. I'm making slight little circles because it's on the end of the V. Slightly wider. If I ran it all in lines, it would chew its skin up. Anytime you're doing any type of shading, it's just circle. Where the big circles, you got a big knee on you, just whip, 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 flip it, whip, 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 whip. Force tight concentric circles to get your solid colors. It's all circles. When it's not, is when you're putting lines in. That's why they hurt more, because it's just a more of a persistent pain and different technique. We got numbing cream up there for people that don't can't take it, but what they don't realize is that the numbing cream don't really work until the skin has been penetrated anyway. Because don't have any way to get inside your skin. Definitely felt that bad. So yeah, basically, other tattoo artists out there, if someone uh, needs a numbing cream, get a bottle of water and write numbing cream on it. Say, I got some numbing cream for you. Spray it on there. They'll be like, man, that stuff works. Placebo. <laughs> <laughs> That is really all in the head. So basically, you like, make your client comfortable. You see how Lane's just laid back. You're not having to fight with his arm on that wobbly. Anything. You're not having to hold his arm up in the air. It's just laying there. Nice and stable. You don't have to worry about a switch or nothing. Unless you're Omar. I remember the doctor I've been tattooing recently. I said, oh my gosh. He can't take it. Oh no, I mean, he jumped all the way across the room. Like, it took me four hours to put an outline I could have done in five minutes. Yeah. And seriously. And then he comes back later wanting part of what my original design on there. After I've already put lines that cross, he asked for too much information for too small of a pay. He wanted the chemical makeup of the human brain, DNA, and a superimposed cross on a Bible that was about this big. I'm like, dude, that's too much. And Psalm something else. Like, that's too much information for that small of a space. It's just going to end up being mush. So I drew it in dimensions. It's all go mix it up. I'll it's all good. I, yeah. I always find a way. Well, so. He'll just have to, like, I don't know, drink a whole bottle before he gets here next time. Just gotta tell me or something. I don't know. Whatever he don't tell me, I guess I'm not liable for Yeah, man up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is it up to tattoo? I think it's hilarious, because I'm tattooing Bob the next day, another doctor, who I've done an entire sleeve on. Where I'm as old as his next sleeve. I'm going to his wedding this summer. Nice. We've developed a nice really good friendship. He drives from two hours away from Newport News. Come to see me every few weeks and has three years. Now he sits there and he's like, you know, we had folder L. Bob for a long time. I still got it like that thick. He got all his information. We don't even look into thing anymore. That's awesome. Yeah, he comes limping in because he had knee surgery or ankle surgery or something. I'm like, man, you're in pain, ain't you? And he's like, yeah, it's hurting for you I guess you need some pain, don't you? Yeah. Take your mind off one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He's cool, man. He's just so cool. You can say whatever, play whatever. It's just Bob. Would you, uh, would, are you not supposed to get tattooed if you're drunk? Huh? Like, are you not supposed to, like... Well, here's the thing. Of course, if you drink enough alcohol, it's going to thin your blood, right? Right. Anybody knows that. But that's not the reason that it's illegal. The reason it's illegal is because your judgment's impaired. 
you might go into a tattoo shop in the middle of the night because you fell in love with this girl at the bar and get her name tattooed on your forehead. That's what it boils down to in the end. But like you said, if you bleed anyway, dude. You really? shouldn't be in the shit, you should be gone. Oh, yeah, you you're too left. deep anyway, so the blood shouldn't really matter that yeah, much. Yeah, I mean, you'll see. I, I definitely feel what you're saying there. I mean, have you, So, did you still, bleed with Alfonso? Have you seen did any you blood at all? Now, I, I am required to have a blood spill kit on the wall. That's by law. But the people who made the laws never tattooed. So we had that argument with them too. Just a few months ago, me and Trey sat there. I told him what to do while he sat there silently. I introduced him last. I was like, just so in case y'all didn't listen to me, you listened to Trey who sat there silently behind the person telling you the truth the entire single time. So, now talk to him, please. <laughs> It's all good. That's what they asked me there for, to mediate. An industry that was about to implode. So I told them the problem. Gave them four out of five solutions. Gotta make them try a little bit. Yeah, that's right. That's right. And then uh, took me and Jesse Smith four hours to get through to them. So they thought I was interrupting. Really, I was reinforcing everyone. That it, it everyone said it. I was agreeing with and reinforcing because I told them as soon as I walked in, the problem was evident. That there's a table between them and us, and they won't let us sit at the table, and their microphones won't even cut on. So I was like, so how can we possibly communicate with y'all? Y'all are making the laws, and you won't even let us sit at the table, and your microphones don't even work. Uh, so I had to speak up loud and sternly to get them to listen because they couldn't hear the people speaking. Speaking, yeah. And then they couldn't understand what they were saying. So, so, so they thought I was. Yeah. Yeah. They thought so, I was interrupted. I was like, huh? I'm giving like, you a pat on the back. Like fear ball girl. So at and the you, end of the day, they gave us their business cards and told me thank you. There you go. And me and Jesse told them. We're making our own board, and then we're going to tell y'all what to do. Y'all need to hire some people, because what about the enforcement and the corruption? And that's when I walked out. So we made one little step forward. So do you have to pay money for the blood spill, spill there? Oh, of course. So that's basically what they try to do is try to make money off of everybody. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It always boils back down to that. Yeah, yeah. Always. And the thing is, if they listen to my solutions, it's a win-win for everyone. Oh, it completely I, showed them, I showed them like how to make it a win-win for everyone so more people get trained properly and more licenses get issued. Yeah. So, so the more licenses they issued, the more money they make. The more people like train properly, it's a win-win for everybody. Yeah, but they don't want to see that. They want that money right now. Well, I told them that they needed to add. There, there's a big argument between tattoos, apprenticeships, and schooling. I told them they needed both. Yeah, for sure. I thought you need both. Yeah, for sure. Um, and then they're like, well, how many hours is that? I was like, 2,250. They're like, <laughs> Jesse said, that's a good one. No, it's more like a, a lifelong commitment. But you, no matter what, you always learn something. If you learn it. So I do like all the saltwater aquariums, and it seemed like no matter how much you can read, 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 read and do everything they tell you, different tanks are going to require different things. And then once you get a science down, something new to come out. So you always learn it, man. Always. Always learn it. And if you ain't learning, you in the ground. That's right. That's exactly right. You're never going to encounter two skin types that are the same. Ever. Yeah, for sure. 
I've been tattooing for a quarter of a century and I've never seen two people's skin what react about the same. The Even twist, like have you ta ever tattooed twist? Yep, they gonna have a different makeup skin too yeah, though. I've heard that they like, yeah. Well, you, you know, the genetic good. makeup of everything on this planet, including a rock, is 99.99999% the same. Yeah. It's like it's that crazy. one little... Well, yep. <laughs> well, like, well, like one twin, he could be out in the sun. And you know how much all that is? I think <laughs> Yep. Hey, Let's turn that up a little bit and close the door. Just a little, just a little bit. Just a little bit. That's good. I'd rather technology work for me than have to keep working technology. Y'all understand? Can we hear it? Or is it just me with my immortal in my ear? Can you hear it? Yeah, I can hear it. Alright, cool. I can too. Oh, they need a little notch. Yeah, Just a notch. Some of those ears don't, don't work quite as well. Deadpool. 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 Who's about to come out? Captain soon. Deadpool. Nah, just Deadpool. Just wait a damn minute. Alright. So, you wanted uh, reds and greens. In here, correct? Yeah, now, do you want this to look like a candy cane? <laughs> uh, <laughs> 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 That's with you. We're gonna do a little bit more, just some reds and greens. Cause, uh, if we really want this to pop, it needs some shadowish. Here's what I want to know. Who are you? Uh, I'm Captain oh Captain yeah, Grey Watch. <laughs> If y'all are buying gray wash kits, get with it. Oh, I didn't hear any thunder, but out of your fingers, was that like sparkles? We have no candy cane spades. So it's like. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like I, don't know, I, I love to pay $30 for a. Uh, for some watered down. Right? For some watered down. <laughs> <laughs> and then $30 for some more watered down. And 30, yeah. for some yeah. more water. Some people got money like this. You know? Carlo? <laughs> Do you think they have a faucet? <laughs> and really, how many traps do you really need when you can work straight up? So, let's work straight up. With the rotary. What happened to my manners? It's not even uh, made to shave. I properly introduced myself. Come on. Uh, probably. Hey, Trey. My name is Grandmaster. I preside over a little part of the night called the Contest of Champions. We've got the farm. You grab one of those things. You, my friend. Oh, never okay, mind. Part of the new cast. Why do you say that? Well, Thank you, friends, Trey. I don't give a shit about your games. I'm going back to Asgard. Asgard? See, I pre portioned it into the small bottle from the big bottles over there. Because you keep using the big bottles over and over, they get real messy. And there is a bottle of gray wash up there because someone gave it to me because I told them it was worthless. And I haven't touched it. Because it is worthless. What is, what, what <laughs> it'd be good for airbrushing though. What is it just watered down taste? Yeah, it's like half black, half water. <laughs> you started like... And so I just did the same thing in a cup and then I threw it away because we're going to do it straight up. Just by tuning it down. Why are you just going? Whispering. And Trey, uh. I work real good for these parts. I know. In the world, I'd be like, uh. Real bright white. So bright. Bright white. White. I know y'all don't see that, but. In any case. So what I used to call that arch organic dermal pigment. <laughs> that's, a lot, that's a lot of words, so I think I'm just going to call it arts for now. 
Is I make all my own. You take this thing out of my neck and I'll show you. What's your favorite game? Salsa. You want to get back to the place and ask for it? My favorite what? What's the best eat company? Oh, um, well, I don't think there is a best. So all different types all have their own. Yeah, see, different, I use different ones, different companies. Um, I try to stay with reputable dealers that sell to professionals. Especially when it comes to pigments. Other things you might be able to bend your way around, you cannot do it with pigments. The so Arts Organic Dermal Pigment is made from USDA approved all organic components. It's vegan friendly, you can eat it. Gnarly. And no, you can't have the trade secrets, I'm sorry. What, what do you think, what, what about glow in the dark? Do you ever use oh. those? Oh, well, I tried to start a revolution, but didn't print enough pamphlets, so hardly anyone turned up. My mom and your boyfriend. So I mean, it was a little slower, right? Because you know the power of the gene. See, yeah. so yeah, you know how slow I got turned down? Do you know that? Plus, we're working straight up. Ah, yeah, now this one thing is a circle. You barely like, even touch him. Change way down, and barely even touch him. We'll turn it up in a minute. We make it nice and rich. Oh, we just turned it up a little bit anyway. You know, the the kid right and Karen were cut off. Yeah, and here we roll. The what? The kid? Yeah. Just hit start again. It's, it's, the, it's like the little bud. And the I know this is taking longer than it should, but you know what? I am giving y'all an instructional video at the same time. Got you. But I Now, actually, I've progressed past a whole bunch of lessons. Oh, see, if y'all would have paid attention or can skip and not trip, then you would get the red Jake. Is it on? To it? Do you see numbers? So. Yeah, we just having fun. Cause you gonna know when I'm going in. I'll be sure you'll be sure of that. There you go. Cause you'll see pure knowledge all over the stage. Yeah, yeah. Likely not to see my face. So how would you consider how I take getting tattooed? We'll find out in a minute. Uh-oh. Lane, do one thing for me. Hold your arm out at me like this real quick. One by one, my realms became ours. But then, simply because my ambition outgrew his, he banished me, caged me, locked me away like an animal. Before that, Asgard's warriors were on it. Their bodies buried. It's all right. People don't understand it anyway. Like, they were watching with a rotary. It's meant to color. No people. I'm just putting a little teeny bit of gray in the skin. So I can whip the whites back in so they can blend organic breeze within. What happened with the camera? Smaller than I thought of it. Oh, no. I mean. There you go. Trace hands. Oh, it's good. Thank you, Trey. Yes, sir. <laughs> Now, as soon as I get this done for you, because I, I wanted to flesh this out for you, so I just leave this all flat like that. Shut up, dude. Shut up, dude. Shut up, dude. Shut up, dude. In case y'all are wondering, I'm just layering in. Right over the second layer, I'm putting little teeny speckles of gray pigment. I have black pigment. 
Then I'm gonna whip white. Some people call this a gray wash. I'm using solid black to do it though. If you're a beginner, don't even try it. Water down your pigment. What what would be uh and then I'm gonna take white and I'm gonna whip it right back into it. What would be the most logical state of like a beginner if they try to do that? The number one mistake of a beginner? Well, no, if try? Do, no, if they would try to do it, <coughs> they would do it. Mm -hmm. Try. That'd be the number how one would mistake. Out, how, <laughs> how would it come out looking? It would just like mess the whole thing up. Um, you know, well, well, if they had a, a electromagnetic uh, Here's what it looked like. Shader That's what it looked like, in hand, <laughs> That's what it looked like right there. If they have a, a power horse like this with a 3.5 millimeter throw on it, um, that never skips a beat and hasn't for a decade. I would suggest they not touch it for about 10 years. Yeah. Not at all. So, did you believe when you went Alfonso to your tattoo? Oh, yeah. It wasn't fun, it was his brother. Oh, it's little brother. Yeah. And I know some of y'all might be thinking I'm overshading this because I shaded it on one side and now I'm shading it on another, but we're sleeving laying up inevitably. So we're going to want it all to blend together and he wants this piece to be part of it. Otherwise, we'd be covering it. So what we're doing is we're enhancing it and we're leaving it open on the sides to expansion. Anybody's wondering who's playing in the background? This is two guys from Norway. Well, I hope you was watching one of those. And they're really cool. All they do is they sing about nature and mountains and trees and birds and. They ain't worried about a thing. After all, they are called immortal. <laughs> now here's where you gotta be careful coming across this bone. Because it's gonna vibrate. Where it's fleshy, you can get that nice. You can almost get the play from a spring with the bounce of the skin with the harder hit from the rotor. You start to hit these bones though, it creates like a vibration. And right in between the connections, that's where all of the nerves are. So you gotta be real careful right there. I know how that feels. That's the most of the Oh, yeah. Look, the ground. Sitting off the ground, I'll be the other. That color. I'll be the pain. That color bone feels really good. Oh, yeah. I'm totally adept to pain. I love pain. Ah. Makes me so alive. I tattooed pretty much my whole body, except for my back. Trey's gonna take care of that. I've been waiting my whole life to, or I will stand up, look in the mirror, and twist my arms backwards, both ways. Oh yeah, Steven, that's what I'm trying to get tattooed on my back. What? That B, do you see the B? I want to call it a B. Nah, I need somebody to commit me, and I had someone try to work on me, try to imitate what I was doing many, many years ago in my first shop, and uh, well, they got close, but I, I ended up having to tell them that they were lazy, sloppy, one layer, they never finished, loose. They told me they, 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 they were not happy with my, with my uh, uh, they just weren't, I was like, well, dude, it's been like 10 years. I was like, come on, I paid you twice. It's been like 10 years, and I still don't have the outline going. Uh, but you know, dude, no bueno, dude. It's a picture right over here. It's always ready for crowd. 
No blame on the, the wall. Yes, don't stop right now, right there. Okay, we're gonna go around this, and then we will switch it all up completely. Pleasure craft. Pleasure craft. Pleasure craft. Well, see, that's the thing with words. People start interpreting them. They're not meant to be interpreted. They're just paintbrushes also. They're not meant to be heard. They're not meant to be listened to. They're meant to be seen. See, I was hitting them so light, and I'm coming back through real quick. And then, so I don't cause them too much extra pain. I'm gonna do the whitewashing before I do the color. Which again, if you're a beginner, do not even attempt. Go your darkest to your lightest so you don't inadvertently mix within the skin. Once you've gotten about 15 years in or so, you can start to bend the rules and make your own uh, technique. And then you can really do some things. But until then, don't, don't do yellow and then do black. Don't do white and then do red. Because if you wipe the wrong way. Hey, exactly. Everybody knows what happens. Just get it over. Once you start being able to work in every direction, then you'll know when. And if you don't know when, work on yourself. If you can't tattoo yourself, if you're looking up at me and saying this isn't human, then shut the fuck up, bitch. Touch something. Like the best one. Touch the chicken. <laughs> Did you put it on the chair? Oh, yeah, that was so darling. To me, like the worst service that I've ever had. Alright, now I'm going to do a little whitewash. It's only going to take a second. And a lot of you are like, what the heck is a whitewash? Well, I'm about to say you're a little bit. That's Donald Trump. What's up, what's up, what's up? You come on in. You want to for a second. I'll be back, bro. Good to see you. Hey, Bob, right here. All day. That's when we need fire. Wow. I had tuned down to the low that was only running as long as I had electricity. See, watch this. So, that's how I was creating this page. There wasn't even enough electricity to make it go. Oh, now I'm tuning it up there. Crank up the volume. Yeah, it's loud, isn't it? <laughs> Okay, uh, Let's go, buddy. Can you give me that water for me? Yeah. Appreciate it. Hey, we don't need towels. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
What I'm doing right now is just knocking this black out of here. We got this rinse cup over here. Get it most of it. And if we really need to get it, you just turn it up like this. So. That'll get it. Because what happens is you run the needle, it's going to create grooves in the tube. And as you create grooves in the tube, well, that's giving spot for ink to stay. So we're moving from all the way from black to the opposite end of the spectrum. And we're going to make these shadows extremely rich. Like our pockets are about to be. And then we're going to start to get to the actual tattoo finally. I took my time with this to show you all a little video. And really, I'm moving real, real slow. Check out our first rough cut. Oh yeah, we don't have that one published for you. We will. It is? Oops, we got that one published for you. We'll go back even further. Find my Facebook page, scroll down until you see a post of some crazy dude from 2004 in Seattle playing his arm like a fiddle with a 13 Magnum. I was bored. And I was in Seattle. Why not? Was it rain? Right oh, rain every day, just a little bit. A little sprinkle. Yeah, that was a cool place. I mean, you can go from like nice weather with a little misty rain to uh, four foot of snow and snowboarding in 30 minutes. So. Hey, yeah, I know I just dropped that one. You know why? I didn't feel like messing with going underneath that table, but like I said before, anything that hits the floor is dead. There's no five second rule in tattooing. So if you see somebody drop something on the floor, pick it up, and then you go to use it, leave. Oh, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that, if they're so worried about that one needle, or that one tube, you don't need to do that. I mean, come on. <clears throat> come on. They obviously ain't doing something right to begin with. Come on. Exactly. Yeah, we really slowed it down for y'all. That's yeah, all right. How, we don't even use slow or fast, do we, Trey? You know what I mean? Just do they Trey. Go. And how fast should we go? Real quick. <laughs> Real quick. And where do we go? There Real quick. I mean, it don't take no time to get from nowhere to nowhere, does it? Alright. So I know it looks like I've done nothing. But actually, if you were to look closely, very subtle difference. I've made a true gray on the second layer of laying skin by blending black and white together. And I think tattooing is an outdated term. It refers back to like the 50s, 60s and stuff. Scarring people up. Thermal pigmentation is the more proper nowadays, I would say. That's still a little bit for people 
Yeah, you know, they don't quite understand what dermal is or dermis or yeah. epidermis or I, they don't know. It's like that's why I was calling my uh, ink arch organic dermal pigment years ago. And it's not even ink. It's organic dermal pigment. Uh, but I was a little mouthy for people, so now I'm just making it a symbol. I'm calling it arts. Arts. <laughs> yeah. To the yeah, point, right. quicker to yeah, the point. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Pick up all it. And you guess who can have it? Me. I guess what the recipe is. You don't know. <laughs> I don't, I don't <laughs> even know. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I spent about five years researching the chemistry, and uh, Trey watched me make it three or four times in front of a guy trying to steal my recipe. And how much did he know? <laughs> Nothing, he called it Blanco. Alright, let's roll. So, there's obviously a number in here too. Eight, four, life. That's the year I was born. So, let's plan this out a little bit so you don't have a rainbow. Or a Christmas tree. That's the house. Um, so, you're gonna need a blend. What do you feel about orange, Lane? I like orange. Like orange? My favorite baseball team is the orange. Uh, that's, right. my, that's my favorite color. We're gonna need, we're gonna need uh, another two more colors. Uh, Alright. Hey Trey, can I get two more number 13 caps? Orange and blue. Orange and blue. blue. Yeah, number 13. Yeah, that would be awesome. Yeah. Two orange and blue set. <laughs> Sorry, oh, DB Blue. Too many people think that orange is actually the complement of blue. It's not. Realness. Yellow and blue make green, remember? Now we're going to use orange because yellow is a very transparent color. So we want a little bit more pigment in there. I want bright, bright. That is Georgia peach here. Oh, I know I got oh, caramel. That'll do well. Caramel. Okay, right. okay. I knew I had a fresh bottle somewhere. Uh Add it all there so they're all blue. Yeah. Yeah, okay. See, see, I gotta get all that. The little things. Yeah, no doubt. The little things, you're right. I mean, that's life, though. The little things in life make all the difference. Trash. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hey, Trey, can I get a for you? Her hands clean. Can I get some water real quick? Yes, sir. I can just get up. Come on. I can get in the hallway. Hey, got you a cup? Yeah, I got you. Thank you, Trey. Stay there. Put it up, That's right. Yeah, good We'll be ready soon. I ain't even started to move yet. All I've been doing is talking. And, uh, well, I redid all the... I jumped this year. Yeah. But what I wanted was more than just a red and a compliment. Roll your arm out a little bit late. Coming around already. We needed uh, another compliment. Oh, Lord. Now, that's going to be a one issue with going that dark with that purple stuff. 
get a little bit, little bit. How about? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm about to lavender instead. Oh, that was that. That was just like a of Nah, the dark mm. purple's gonna go too dark with the, the black. The lavender's gonna pop. Yeah, I like that. I love lavender anyways, too. Well, that's what we're using. Okay. Lavender and orange. That's like, what about favorite six? Anytime you use one color, it's just like 3D movies, you know? They used to put the red lines inside the green lines. Well, they're doing the exact same thing, so they're just taking one color and putting a compliment right beside it. It's the exact same thing you can do with any color. Mm -hmm. And what's this big trend about 3D tattoos? Well, if you got a scar on you and they're telling me it's a 3D tattoo, <sighs> find a cosmetic surgeon. That's fun. <laughs> <laughs> I can still cover it, but. <laughs> I don't know about that scar unless we take a scalpel or something. The only person this chick wanted to start tattooing it, so I let her put this rose oh that definitely need to get fixed. I was like, that ain't no thing. Um, and she fucking scarred the shit All out right. of her. So, <laughs> I have no plan. So let's keep it that way. She was like the worst too, all heavy handed her. Check out my notes, y'all. Water. Air. Energy. Now we're working with lighter pigments. They will look a little discolored at first. Because you will start to see the plasma discharge. Especially when I'm doing small, tight, concentric circles. You see how much I'm worried about it blending, right? Just in case y'all want to know, you can always take control you know, and wrap it around it like this. Make it real surgical for yourself. And it probably will help you out if you only look at one little teeny piece at a time. See that? One little teeny piece at a time. If you try to look at the whole picture, you're going to miss a whole bunch of spots. You know, I might be thinking, hey, what a fucking cocky asshole. You know what? I'm not even here. <laughs> so, I'm glad that somebody thought that and heard that. I hope you feel it. There's a big difference between uh, cockiness and uh, knowing what do you're it. doing. <laughs> Just copy your confidence and see if it's Just like there's a. Oh, is that light getting a little bright? I mean, it is, ain't it? Is the candle still going? There we go. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> so we just turn down the light. Yeah, I don't care what book y'all gonna buy, it's just his story. We ain't here to tell you his story, we're gonna tell you the truth. Now 
Y'all you know, can't handle the trees and put me on the street. Guess what? I got a tent. Oh yeah, Trey, don't I know how to do that? Oh yeah, yeah. As you don't know. <laughs> With multiple stories and multiple rooms and yeah. for kids to play in. It's fun. I used to work in the children's museum in Richmond. I love kids. I used to love teaching skating lessons. Those were my favorite things. I never even thought I'd be skating. And that was the teaching thing. Right. It's all art, one way or another. Yeah, I, some things I don't think you can teach. I don't know. It's like you, you can't really teach. They're innate, yeah. You just kind of show that they, they kind of come. Yeah, you gotta learn your own style. Yeah. So they yeah. can show you how to do it, but you gotta figure it out yourself. How exactly. you like it? Exactly. Right. It's not like math and stuff like that. No, you there is no right answer. The only answer is the only right answer is your answer. Exactly. Yeah, you can't make a mistake. Uh, it's impossible. Well, because even if you make a mistake, what is that? Learning. Okay, okay. you never stop I'm learning. Just, uh, thank you. I, well, not, uh, uh, I'm not even going to try to explain. If I do, I'll just might blow your brain. So, my uh, Just listen to me. <laughs> what do we got? Two and two. Right. Uh, Got it. Rather than switch colors a million times, I just made a pattern up. You'll see it come to life. So I'm gonna do each color separately so I don't have to change colors a hundred times. I can just change colors four times. Well, five, seven. And we're not gonna be doing too much blending, because if you blend out any purple, it's gonna end up being pink. And we did plenty of pink on lane last time. What we're gonna do is alternate our main colors every other letter and then bring down the, the complements that are closest to each other from the top alternating as well so that they interlace and then put a highlight through the middle. And that's what I bounced on here. So, thank you. And I really am holding it in. I mean, I might talk, but y'all ain't gonna help me yet. So, so I could get by. I ain't starting. So, um, satisfaction. So y'all are ready to go look up some excision and some tech nine. I think you're moving fast. Yeah. Satisfaction. So what time are we going to fish tomorrow night? A little bit. Where y'all going fishing? Upper Jeeves. Huguenot. What part of James? Huguenot. I live my Check life. Down. Live my life vicariously through the river. 
What part are you gonna have? Like down, way down, like Watkins yeah. Landing? No, no, no. Uh, right, uh, right where Watkins dumps. Be uh, careful with anything in that river. Oh, I already know, bro. Make sure that you're down way past all the uh, built industries. Yeah, power plants and everything. I know. Mm -hmm. Make sure you're way <clears throat> ahead of that dam. I mean, way ahead of it. That thing's backed up for a long ways. Yeah, this stuff's nasty. The mercury yeah, levels. You might be getting a three eyed. Uh, uh, yeah. Right the mercury levels through the roof. Yeah. My son tried to tell me that mercury would die. And that that's why the, the thermometer wasn't working right. And I had to pull it out and explain to him. I was like, there's no mercury in here. You see this? Watch. It's a computer chip. And I snapped it back in. And it read 98.6. <clears throat> so it's uh, like you shouldn't fish it at all? Or you no, it's not the eat. fishing, it's uh, consumption. Yeah. Like, yeah. And, yeah, it's the consumption, yeah. Uh, well, a big thing is a lot of people think fish that are slimy or nasty. Actually, the slime code is what protects the fish. The slimier he is, the healthier that fish is. Thank you. Uh, I'm trying to teach my son the same thing because he yeah. washes his hands like every five minutes. And I'm like, dude, stop. Stop. You don't have to wash your hands that much. Your body has a certain amount of bacteria on its skin that it needs. It needs, yep. It needs. It's helping you. Yep, so. Um, so, yeah. you know, don't scrub everything that's protecting you off. Well, that's why we produce uh, oils. Exactly, I mean, it's... I like just because something's like microscopic doesn't mean that it's bad. That's correct. Well, a lot of stuff is spent to, like, get off the bacteria, even though it's small, large, and small. Well, that's... That bacteria will kill a lot of things. Exactly. Uh, well, it's the circle of life, though. Everything has its counter. Well, they said people who are, like, germaphobes end up getting sick of the people Exactly. Are. That's why I'm trying to teach my son to stop. Because I'm like, you're just gonna make yourself sick by washing your hands all the time. Yep. Yeah, you know how many antibiotics I've taken in my life? None. I can't. I'm allergic to them. They will kill me or hospitalize me. I've had to fight off everything naturally. And I've broken every bone in my body and uh, have lots of surgeries that take up a couple pages. Uh, yeah, I can't, I can't have penicillin or... Uh, penicillin, yeah, no penicillin. No penicillin, sulfur, cephalosporides, or any multi-drugs allowed. I used to have to wear a medical bracelet as I was a child. Say that. Well, I can say it, but... Uh, that was that allergy. Yeah, spontaneous ain't uh, uh, reason either. When I told this caseworker the other day about my lungs, and they, they're like, what? How, how did that happen? How did you die nine times? How did your lungs collapse nine times? And you get corrective surgery twice. They're like, I don't know, they told me spontaneous. Spontaneous what? Spontaneous pneumothorax? Like, I never heard of that. Like, me neither. Sounds like an excuse, not an answer to me. But they had a way to fix it. Yeah. Oh, or do an experiment. Um, so they removed the lining of my lungs and attached my lungs to the inside of my chest. Like you would two pieces of clay, they sliced up the inside of my chest, the outside of my lungs, and they sewed them together and they said, oh, you'll be fine in four months. Four years later, they did the other side. Tell me if that's how you want to spend 10 years. And then people are talking about pain. It's like, shoot. That wasn't even pain. I pulled the tubes out my side and walked out the hospital. So until I'm ready, just... Let's just keep on smiling and being nice. But that's all anyone ever has to do, really. Enough of the spikes. Everybody's got them spikes. I just have a lot of them. So, 
it's all good, y'all. No matter what you've been through, no matter who's died, no matter what is going on in your life, stay positive. Keep on smiling. Keep on keeping on. Keep on keeping on. Keep opening the door for people and saying, have a nice day. That's yeah, right. Kill them with Life's Like cigar, dig it. Don't think of yourself as a race because you're always being a race. Think of yourself as human and kindness will come. Human, that's right. You, you see, what they, they, we're using lavender. Purple right now. Purple man come down and we still fighting like clans. What do you think gonna happen? Purple is the side of royalty. Come on. Y'all get it together. Get it together. Get, get it together. Like Lane Rowland says, with the paper houses, y'all need to get it together. Yeah. Watch one of those other episodes. You'll understand. Alright, now then. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, we'll go over here for a second in a bit. Well, I'm about to finish. Uh, have a trade power up the base cannon. Whatever that was, that felt really good. So good? Yeah. It might not in a second. <laughs> Eyes move a little quicker. I'm a weirdo though. I like that. Oh, you ain't weird. I think I went about a sadomasochist. That was uh, Bob. Remember I told you about Bob? Yeah. Doctors need doctors too. Physical therapy. Anyone you stab about a million times in a row, everything's coming out. That's all right. That's so I, I guess it would almost be a form of like acupuncture in a, in a weird way. Well, what I used to tell people when they were little, oh, I guess when I was little, have with me, guys? <clears throat> Don't I think I'm like 20 or something? <laughs> uh, anyway, another story, another day. When I come to put this uh, highlight in here, see, right now, you can't even see it. I'm not gonna see it for the last five minutes. But once you see me, then I am gone. Or oh, you're right there. All the time. Lane calls me on time every time. Trey don't even bother call. He knows where to be. He needs to be there. Most of y'all are like, man, he's crazy, man. No, y'all are crazy. I'm insane. <laughs> you might think that that sounds crazy, but if you just listen to the words, I'm saying that I am in the same. I am insanity. Why would I have it any other way? Are you insanity or are you crazy? Crazy. Where is Chris? Idiocracy. So good. Let's, let's talk about this. The energy for tomorrow has already began. Let's talk about flat earth. Oh yeah, that's that's right. Did they say it was round? What you Did they say the universe what? 
Adam, what? Who, what? He, he, what? <laughs> so, what, hey. is, what is your opinion on Flat Earth? Do you think. Here's my opinion. Let's go caveman style. Give me a hammer and a chisel. I'll drop outside of this uni verse. Oh, what was that? Flat one. one verse. I'll jump outside of this one verse and split it like an atom with a hammer and a chisel and go bang. Bigger bombs, better bangs. Let's ask questions later, y'all. Ain't y'all tired of the same old verse? I don't want to. I want a ball to you, man. Well, that's the thing. People divided it all up. Oh, or was it just someone that divided it all up? But too bad they had to piss that person off. Named my first band. I was having band practice when I was 16. People walked in, it was my uncle and my brother. My brother that molested me and beat me when I was a kid and my uncle that I ain't seen in years. As I was having band practice for band of topsis. And then I was told that my mother had been shot with a 38. They were like asking me to brace myself. I think it went all the way around. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So, she's right there. She's always there. Always. Oh, I'm just a little jostle. I'm just a little jostling this for you. A little bit. It's gonna work perfect. So we got two colors that if we blend it out would make pink. So we're using more solids. And just blend out a little bit, leaving a little bit of space. Making the compliments come at angles between the letters so that it reads correctly. You have to interlace it. Get rid of the numbers. Remember the frequency. But he ever died. Yeah. I just made poor decisions when I was younger. We all did. We all do. Oh, so it makes make us them. human, right? Yeah, I still make them down. That's why I like uh, Zootopia so much, is uh, Giselle. Her song. Things about making those uh, great mistakes and that she can't wait to make them every day. That's a big movie. That's what I like. But you can't, I only ever had like three art lessons from the same teacher. She told me, Lee, draw what you see. That's the question I wanted to ask you. He said, Lee, draw what you see. He said, remember, you can't make a mistake. And when you're done with any picture, go back in and put the darkest and the brightest spots in. 
because that's what makes your eye travel around the picture. And that's the only three art lessons I've ever had. Mm -hmm. That's why I repeat it. Because everyone's the same thing. We're all working. All hands are the same hands. So I had a lot of people asking me this question. They want to know. I know the answer. I know the answer. I know you know the answer. Because. That's right. <laughs> and the question is why. <laughs> yeah, they say why. You say we're good. Yeah, that's that's every it. single time, dog runs around <laughs> in circles. Yep. That's <laughs> the gospel. Now, lady, what were you gonna say? I'm sorry. Uh, well, what made you get into tattoo? Like, what made you want to start tattooing? Okay, now. I wasn't sure at first until I had a conversation with this girl named Christine. It's spelled Christ, I-N-E, Christine. I was very upset the other day. It was about a month ago. I didn't know why I was upset. I kept telling people to look up a tree named David Odom. A tree named David Odom. A tree, because there's a species of tree named David Odom. There's one in Pennsylvania and there's one in Portland. Christine was the love of his life. I didn't know why I kept telling people that that night. But you can look it up on Facebook. Just look up a tree named David Odom. That's my cousin. At my grandfather's funeral, right before the death of my mother, was the death of my grandfather, who was in the Navy for 44 years and helped rebuild Japan after World War II and was one of the only admirals ever. Well, this is the last time I saw all the odium at one spot and I saw my first cousin, David, after the ceremony with his shirt off. And he was fully tattooed, kind of like me. It's the first time I'd ever seen something like that. Now there's a tree named David Odom. Everyone thought he had a perfect life. A perfect wife. Wore a motorcycle jacket like that one right over there. They found him in his garage without a head. So like I said, we all got some of that. I just happen to have a whole lot of that. But you don't see me crying, do you? All that's gonna make me cry is my son. I was done a long time ago. So if you got kids out there, take care of your kids. Don't worry about what happened in the past. They don't dictate your future. You don't have to beat your kids because you were beaten. You don't have to go out and kill because you've seen death. You don't have to take down the ship with you because of all of that. There's other people on it. You want to keep the ship afloat. So, you know, haters are going to hate. Lovers are going to love. You know, and there's a lot more haters out there, a lot more negativity than there is love. But you know what changes the world? You just open in the door and saying hello with a smile on your face. Just be nice. You could prevent a tragedy. Just be nice. That's all you have to do. And tomorrow, I'm going to be showing severely abused children for free how to be free because they need that. And money can't buy that, so I would never charge a thing. So thank you, Lane, for your donation of uh, all them skateboards. And I do hope that you can make it tomorrow. No, definitely so you can uh, shoot. I need someone. I need someone on video anyway, and on camera. 
because it's often I can do it. I uh, you know I can skip through it. Um, but I mean I, I'll paint with the, every kid, take pictures too. But uh, so much easier when you got more hands working with you. No, I definitely would be the definitely cover. And I think I, I really need that, especially since it, I'm not being able to get my daughter involved. I think it'd be very good for everybody involved. Um, you get to meet my buddy Eric. He runs the Petersburg Art League now. And, and that's where my mom's from. That's like my family's been good for a lot of our family. My mom was like sick of boys free. Yeah, I don't even know where I'm going yet. You know how much I look at a map? Uh, sometimes. I, I'm really good with direction. I'm a GPS type of guy. That's true. Yeah, I mean, I started using that too for a while until so it started getting me lost. I just remember growing up, I ain't had none of that. I just got in the car and just went. It was pretty simple. The, the signs will tell you where to go. And if you get lost, you just follow the arrows. They always look back through. And are you never really lost? Yeah. Wherever you go, that's where you're at. That's right. It just is. Is, is, is it? That it is. Is, is. Now, except is. Wisdom can't be taught, it must be sought. Is, though. Wisdom is, though. Oh, did that an owl or something? Oh, I know it's the, the, uh, the master teacher is the master student. That's how you become the master teacher. Because what I show these three-year-olds in two seconds, they will teach me more than I learned in 40 years in three seconds. I just put the tools in your hands. And tell them that they're free. Attention, Yards of America. Now you have a holiday too. Toro days at the Home Depot. With the best prices of the season on the latest Toro push mowers, zero turn mowers, blowers, and trucks. Now, hopefully, I didn't make this to too bright for you. No, we can always get darker. Then get outside and enjoy the holiday. The best oh, prices boy. of the season on Toro. Happy Toro. Well, I haven't gotten Home to the Depot. brightest part yet, but we're about to. Offers valid April 19th. I gotta get this, uh, hey, it's out the this real quick. pardon the interruption, but I have to ask, what exactly are you waiting for? Your awesomely rewarding career is closer than yeah, you I didn't do a blend on purpose. Like I said, there was too much red and lavender, which we're going to turn to paint. Healthcare are the focus, and you can learn in less and time than hands-on approach. Plus, ECPI's University Ooh, Career Services team that's a nice helps phase. you with your new career. Go to ecpi.edu and get started. That's not even ECPI. white. But, you know what, it's bright. Let's go. Bright, bright. Bright, bright. Bright, bright. Bright, bright. Uh, yes, sir. Ciao. Trey's on time. I don't even know how I got in touch with you the other day. I'll oh, be quietly. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll be quietly. I'll be quietly. Support your local PHUMC. If you don't know what I'm talking about, just look it up. PHUMC. And support.
Especially if you're in the military or government. Or you were. And you didn't really like being trained to kill a thousand to one. You don't really appreciate what's been done to you. But you might need some companionship. Some brotherhood. You're not alone. They're just fun having charity, giving people. I don't know why they came up with that better. They come up often in my mind. They know how to use their mind. Start to see a little bit of plasma. You ain't gonna see real blood. But where I'm putting this white in there, you'll see a little bit of plasma. And it's actually good because you can use that as a good gauge while it's healing. Especially in the first 24 to 36. When it's pushing plasma. As a good indicator is you need to rinse it off. Only thing that makes Tad Twink <laughs> How 
far we we into this now, okay? That movie. Oh, I think it's, it's been in the people, right? Bobby, man. Yeah. What well, was positive? And Bobby. I know that Bobby. number. Oh yeah, it was Bobby. Uh, All right. Bobby from Apollo. Alright, Hawk, Hawk is back to Bruce. He's right? Huh. Yeah, I think he won't tell me. Yeah, that's who it was. It's been minimum. Oh, it's like, it. take the screen and uh, downsize it a little. I should chill and hold this thing. Huh? There we go. Probably a little bit, a little better. It's just running in circles, huh? Yeah, I tried to skip it a little bit further. Did you check the Wi-Fi? It don't matter. Oh, it is a store of Ragnarok. And he just found the... Well, he just finally got the Hulk to calm down. Because he's been the Hulk for two years, lost on a planet that don't exist in a space between spaces. And they made them fight each other. And the Hulk comes out and Thor's like, Yes! We work together! <laughs> and then he kicks his, the Hulk's butt. But then the, the guy that runs the place like has a little zapper and zaps him. He's like, Man, listen to me. Asgard's in trouble. I need you to come help. And in the midst of it, he finds a Valkyrie. Valkyrie. Hey. Valkyrie's the dark skin girl. She's the last left. Um, the most elite fighting force they had was all women on horseback. That's what Bob asked me to put on him. One of the founding members of the PHUMC. His wife was dying of cancer. He asked me to turn her into a Valkyrie angel on his arm. So I did. Picture of it? Nope. Somewhere. Maybe. That's saying I've got so many. It's um. Uh, I don't think it's even like humanly like, possible. To know how many pictures I've created. Because you know. So people will stop to count and post and stuff. And people are, oh, I love the stuff you've been posting. I'm like, really? And I think you're seeing trickle too. That's it. I just don't stop. And neither do you. Reality moves around you. It spirals. Going in all directions. You never even move. Get that, and then the trail runs true. Now you just learned Aikido. Sir, it's all good. It's part of that old trip. Get in. It's 
Except for when they did my second uh, corrective lung surgery. I told them for four days that something wasn't right. They wouldn't listen to me. I said, look, something's not right. Something's not right. Something's not right. Something's not right. Something is not right. You all supposedly just corrected this lung, and I'm telling you that my lung is collapsed. I know my own body. I had this happen to me lots and lots of times. Finally, they listen to me, and they bring in a, a portable x-ray. And they're like, holy shit, your lungs collapsed. I'm like, no friggin' kidding. I've been telling y'all that for four days. Y'all left me here in the dang bed. And that's the one that y'all just corrected? That's spelled It's all mal, man. That's why I, I hold it all in, really. That is the tip of the dang iceberg. I, I can start from birth and just keep on going. Ain't nobody gonna believe a word of it. I don't give a crap. Go look it up. Do you even keep medical records from 30 years ago? Oh my god, especially with stuff like that, we're doing people all sexy. Yeah, they're pretty sloppy. Yeah, they don't. I know they don't. Because I had a hernia operation two years ago because of a hernia operation that I had when I was little that had burst. And so they could do it orthoscopically like they do nowadays. They had to cut me open like a C-section because they had no clue what they did 30 years ago. Just lasers out. Well, they do it. They, they, they punch a bunch of holes in you and then they stick instruments inside you and they hang you on the computer screen. And if they drop a sponge or, or something, they just say forget it and just leave it inside of you. Yeah, I've seen some lady get things like fucking scissors. It's just the truth of it. Because they don't have hands to better grab it. They can tear you up more with instruments. Kind of dirty. That's fucked up. Mm-hmm. I was telling that lady the other day, it was giving me an interview. I was like, she didn't even believe me. I'm like, yeah. It's like... I was like one of the first people to even have the surgery done. And then four years later, it was called in practice. And you shoot someone up with morphine every six minutes for six days and see it for Captain. She said, oh. I'm like, yeah. Whatever. I'm like, I didn't even fall asleep. I was carrying around my insides to talk to the ghost. Well, I mean, I did land there. This dark fella from Brooklyn named Joe. Well, fuck you. Found Jeff. me on the floor. Moaning. My, my freaking friend told me the darling story yesterday. I don't know if it's completely... He said, don't die on me. And he threw me in the car. He won't wait on the ambulance. He said, well, just don't die on me. 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 When, when did this happen? 2004. Whoa. Let me turn it up for a second. Oh, come on. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Come on. Come on. That's it. Minimum, like, uh, make it yeah, make it a little smaller. And it usually, oh, uh, doesn't matter. Uh, All this is Odin is, uh, reminded Thor something. After he just uh, hit his sister with the biggest lightning bolt of all known lightning bolts, and it did nothing. Well, he don't know that yet. It knocked him down. To save his people, he destroys his planet. You talk to Bobby. Duh. Because it's not about a planet, it's about a people.
So all y'all that ain't with it, I would suggest you get with it. Hey Trey, let's power up the base cannon real quick. Grab that for me. What's the base cannon? Oh, just a little clip. Power that up. Just go to YouTube. Okay, if I'm about. No, I want I want excision. Find it. you'll go to YouTube, you'll find it very quickly. I only got a couple marks left to make. All I want is the first little team did anyway. So that's where it's out the frame. And talk to you the same. And the reason that this hurts a little bit more. Well, it always hurts a little bit more when you put the light in. It's not that it's any different. It's the last step. Take the last little bow, you fucking mm -hmm. That's Thor. That's Bear, the guy I was talking about earlier. He's a big teddy bear, Bob. E X like the incision with an X E X X. It should be uh, if you go to YouTube. I see there's a uh, Tech Nine with excision. I right, go there, scroll, scroll. All right, now go to search. All right, excision E X. Alright, excision, final warning. Good enough. Forget the base cannon. Let's see. Oh, what do we got here? Well, let's just hit the final warning. Let's just hit that one. Why not? I was gonna hit the base cannon, but. Is it up? All the way up. You go over your bright spots once, you go over it twice, you let it go. Because it's in there. Trust yourself. It's not going to show true at first. It's swollen, distorted. Oh, I never heard actually this was. Sounds like pleasure trap. Oh, we were just listening to that. Y'all thought that was fast, right? Real quick. Sounds like something else I've heard. Different genre, different band. Ah. I love it. He's playing with y'all. He burned down the stage every time. Every time. Alright, Link. Tell me if that's too bright for you. Oh, it could be. Or I can add some variants in there. 
This is fucking crazy. I don't remember what it looked like before, but it's a lot different now. And it'll brighten up by the morning. You gotta let that plasma push to 24 to 36. Most of this is gonna happen in the next two. What we could do though, if we wanted to, is come in with a little dark purple right here. Right, Whatever we want to do. The reason I didn't before is so I didn't want to hit this. Are you holding that? I put that little four of white in there. So I also don't want to call it your skin. You know what I'm saying? So we might just want to wait. Let it heal. Do you like how I did the shading around it? Yeah, it Fill it out. I don't know. Go, go look in the mirror. Go look in the mirror. Yeah. 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 It's still playing with it. <laughs> well, oh. That's a long song, man. <laughs> nah, that's a real that's short song. Like, they're just playing. Yeah, I'm going to get the shit out of there. That just sounds real hard to me. <laughs> that's a repair. We'll come back to it. We put enough layers in there. Now, uh, Lane, how do you take care of it? So what do we do? How do you take care of a tattoo? Uh, just blast it with water for a couple. I'm gonna wrap you up for a little while, right? Yeah. And then you gonna open it up with really warm water to exfoliate the skin and open those That's holes that I just punched in you up. Clean it out real good. You know it's not gonna take the ink out. I just put it in you. Yeah. And that's what I did. You gotta let it breathe. Just pat it dry. Let it breathe. Pat it dry. Let it breathe. Keep it clean. Let it breathe. Oh, thank you, sir. Hugs good, right? That's why I'm gonna get a picture right now. I'm gonna we'll see where we're at. Right now, you are in the middle of secondary healing, which means it has. You do have a fresh layer of skin. This little teeny bit of scaling this will go away. It's got secondary healing going on. Your next generation of skin. You're always shedding skin cells. You just don't notice. Um, I can't get I don't know. Come on. Wendy. I love you, Wendy, but you need to pop in my phone like that. Nah, I definitely don't need to be looking at myself. Nah, take your selfies. Hehehe. It ain't the sound of a Oh, what we'll, we'll do we do one now, real quick? Why not? Uh, let's take a picture of that, too. And for that, we really need... See, because you can't get a good picture when you're the first done. They're swollen, they're distorted, they're bright. Yeah. I don't even know why I just took this picture through. It's asking me to share it now. Alright, share it to who? Is it Facebook? I don't even know what the heck. It might be Google. I'll just, I'll just send it to Wendy. Whatever. Alright. No, I hit camera. Ready? I didn't even get the before. You know what? I got it. I don't care. We did get a before. Oh. Um, and that's awfully bright. So, I know you like bright. But if we want downturn there at all, I originally selected a really dark purple. Why do I like the dark purple? Well, that's what I mean. Yeah, that's what I mean. Let's see. No, you will. I started out with the dark purple and then I moved towards the lavender because see, I think it see how dark? See how dark? Yeah. This is, I didn't want to interfere with the black. Uh, Sit down for a second. Um, yeah. uh, have to do this real quick. Yeah. And then, uh, I don't give it to me. 
Alright. And then I gotta clean up. But let's do this real quick. You want to And as a matter of fact, let's do one other thing real quick there. Since we're gonna do that, let's do this to uh and we'll take care of all of that. You want us to go? Is that black? Yeah. So this is the tattoo I said you would check fuck you up. Alright, let's go. Alright, here we go. Awesome news, please. Thank you. Thank you, Bob Harris from the Glad to hear from you too. But that's not what I want. What I want is. We're fulfilling the prophecy. I hate this prophecy. So do I, but we have no choice. Sergio destroys Asgard, he destroys Hella so that our people may live. But we need to let him finish the job otherwise. Can't find the video one, so let's just see what happens. Alright. Now then, since I put that white in there, be careful if you ever do something like this. Now we don't need a lot. You need a little bit, right down here. Remember what I told you to begin with? Go back and find your darkest spots and your brightest spots. Now you gotta be careful when you go in this many layers, Trey. Okay? Pay a close attention to the skin. Because, well, technically we've only put one layer in there. But, it's solid. What I really wanted to do is create a space in between those darks. See? Without that space in between, you would lose the line completely. Now what you thought was black was olive. And so I'm going back just like I went into that lavender where I had the lighter green. Going back in, putting little teeny dark spots.
And then we can always add on to it. Yeah, that was the plan anyway, right? Yeah, that's the thing. Whenever you're working with somebody else's stuff, so. I was ready to get on your chest, but I'm glad that we took care of this. What does it say? Oh, yeah. That about fits perfectly. Considering you uh, donated all them skateboards, and we're gonna tear it up. Don't expect me to be doing another trick though. I'll roll nice and... <sighs> Unless you want me to do like flips or stuff like that. Alright, I'll be painting. I'm sure you'll be painting too. Yeah, I definitely will paint for you. I am sure when you're skateboarding, you're painting. <clears throat> right? Right, right? Right. You told me bright. I made it bright. Now we just whip it out. Oh, it's all good. That's the thing. You can always uh, go to darker. Going the other way around is a little tougher. <laughs> Well, I could have done it all in one color, like just all one color across, and then all one color across. But uh, I like this a lot. Yeah, I like it a lot. I like it. I like it. And then what I'm going to do is work out, well, I've already got to work out in my head, your chest, but I'm trying to get something down on paper a little bit, just to, um, it doesn't really matter, but I'll, I'll make some scribbles, make some notes, commit it to the memory. If I don't, I'm off, just remind me. Tattooed for a while, man. Eh? How long did you tattoo? Two hours. Seriously? Yeah. Two plus hours, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And this is really something that could have taken me like. But I could have done this in 30 minutes. That's good. But, That's really you know, good. it's all worth it because we're hanging out. We got to talk. I got to show people a lot of different things, different techniques. Um, information. We got to talk, and I don't remember what this looked like before we started, but I know it did not. Oh yeah, y'all seen it backwards and upside down in that thing, ain't you? Well, it says "Skate for Life," and now you can read it just right. Hi. <laughs> uh, can you get a picture here? Code name X. Yeah, he's tight. I just don't like playing too much.
sir. When you get a chance, send me like a before or something. I'll definitely send you a before. There you have it, guys. Awesomeness. And we're still, we're still going to go that, that picture. Can you send me that? Yeah. Yeah, I'll send you everything I got. Thank you guys for watching. Yeah, those colors look so good together. It's gonna look better. Yeah. Yeah, it will. Jellyfish is nasty. I cannot wait till my whole arm is just completely covered. Let me get you. Um, I need to get this clean up. My son, I didn't realize that we had spent as long as we did. But it's all good. I mean, you brought me all them skateboards. We had to take care of that. Then we gotta film this documentary in the bar. Yeah, it's all good. Like, I'm gonna be teaching, so it's, I'm gonna leave that all up to you. So, um, what time are you, what, what time are we getting together? That's what I was gonna talk about. Um, I talked to my dad. He wants to take us out to, I mean, we really should be trying to get there like by 1.30 or 1, 1.30, 1.30, something like that. Oh, yeah, cool. Um, I mean, that's perfect. The wrap up. And I'm staying at his house tonight, so I'm like, I'm pretty much like right down the street with the beer. What you need? Just a tape on top of that. Got you, I got you, I got you. That's the one thing I do not use. Medical tape, because I've seen more allergic reactions to that than anything. Hey, will we open it? I got you. I got you. Alright. Um, more allergic reactions to that than anything. So what I do is I just tack down a dental bib. It stays on for an hour or two. The petroleum I'll put in there is a one-time thing. It's gonna rinse all that down the drain with really warm water. Fully skin, pat it dry. Notice plasma coming to the surface later, rinse it off. Most important rinse is in the morning, three fingers, a little bit of soap, get any. Those light areas are gonna show you where the plasma is. Get all that off. Okay, got you. No. And then- When do I really wash it with soap though? Like three days? Like. Well, just go about your business at that pretty much. Gotcha. If you got any questions, just call me. Well, that's what I do. Like, just keep it clean, let it breathe. So, guys, we're finished. Thank you for watching. And um, tomorrow we got an awesome video that is going to be super awesome. We're going to be paint boards. We talked about it earlier. But we're going to actually um, have an intro and all that stuff for tomorrow. Can't think that clearly right now because your boy's still in a little bit of pain and all and that. my endorphins, endorphins. Are like, yeah my endorphins are like going off i got like this crazy natural out right now yeah me awesome. too it's all good i gotta get to my boy like i arranged them out because i knew that when you coming in that we were gonna sit here and we were gonna talk, talk and then you came one night so then you had all these boards coming so I had my father pick up my son. But now I gotta clean up so I can get to him. You need help and clean and, up? Uh, no, me and Trey got it. Sure, you I'll just take care of y'all stuff. I love you, And uh, we'll be at y'all tomorrow. And so we'll be doing something totally different. And uh, we're just gonna be painting. And hanging out with the kids. Hanging that's, out that's with the kids and paint. And saving lives. That's that's, that's right. right. That's a train the house. Saving and I'll changing. <laughs> hey, man. I ain't got a whole lot to say. Trey, Trey's a quiet person. Too. You coming too? <laughs> bro. That's you, my Trey. You coming to Yeah. Oh, my God. Leo, Leo, say Trey's going. Say, that's why Trey's Trey. Yeah, I'm really... Yeah, you got me double. I got me double. Right, right? Yes. Oh, I'll just hold it for the... We can cut that camera off. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Peace out. Bye. Oh, my God, man. Hey, Trey, can you start... Kill... Kill that camera. Die, camera. Aborigine. <laughs> 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 I didn't know there was a Hey, Lane, I did not anticipate that taking that long. Really?
I didn't think but, it was going to take more than that. Oh, it should have taken more than, I had you more than that, like, in, before you got here. Like, way, 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 way more. But, you know, I was going to say, what I got to expect from you, Tom. Well, you got to, like, um, I mean, you were talking the whole process. I know. It was I was telling people what I was doing. You asked me to, remember? Yeah. And I think that's just like, it, it helps to engage the audience a little bit more. No, it does, because I am telling people, like, I'm teaching people, actually. Um, Some so, of them will listen. That's the great thing about YouTube, though, man, the tutorials. Well, that's what I'm saying. When they get yeah. tutorials, I mean, I mean, Trey knows. I, I, I'm an instructor. I work here at school. Uh, Oh my gosh, man. Oh God. I need to get some better drill. <coughs> yeah, take care of that. Hey, that R piece, what do you think? Ballpark figure. Um. Which R piece? This. <laughs> Clean up. I have no clue at the moment. Uh, Is it with extensions? It all takes sessions. What I always tell people is time and patience. Uh, take your time, be patient with the process, and then it'll all work out. Stay positive, keep your head up. Yes. And it, as you heard me divert off a few times during my uh, whatever while I was tattooing, you know, that ain't nothing. This stuff happening always. That's, that's kind of why I threw it in there. I think it'll probably... I, I don't know. I, I can't even ask. I'm, I don't even want to. Oh! Why are you looking at like three sessions out? I, I just wanted to make an estimate. A guesstimate. Oh, what? Oh, I was just saying about how many sessions it might take to actually fix that his tattoo. Yeah, that's what I was saying. It's hard for me to guess at the moment. It's going to be a few seconds, yeah. What you should do is take the number down so you can at least schedule a consultation with him, and then y'all can come in here and chat, and then he'll be able to, like... Yeah, that's the easiest way. All right, just chill. I got your card. You know what I mean? That's so, the easiest way. Just come in for an actual consultation. I'll sit down with you for free. Um, and sure. we'll work out the details. Um, hey, Lane. Yeah. Do you want to make another appointment to work on your chest? Yeah, um... Ooh, how did this happen? Friday, oh, yeah. <laughs> after, that was Jason. This morning, I don't even know. This is good. It happened, like, it's just water. Friday, after this, same, same thing, if that's cool. Let's see. I'll be right back after this. Right. 
Sometimes you gotta do that, right? Oh yeah. Give him back a little to get him to the Yep. Alright, so this got soaked, but I think these paper towels are just sticking together. So I can get them home. Clean it up, get to my boy. It's funny, I didn't, I didn't even use these. It's <laughs> just in case. Yeah, it's alright. Yeah, I wanted it to just stay silent, but I couldn't. I couldn't do it. I mean, I didn't say much about them, no. Hello. Hi. I just finished. I'm cleaning up and I am headed your way. All right. Well, how are you? Did you have a good day at school? Okay. Well, I'll see you soon. Okay, cool. So what's out? Um, but you just want to text me in the morning. I'll text you in just a little bit. I gotta talk to my dad. I'm guess where I'm about to stop at next. That'd be cool. Just gotta get this thing up. Honestly, yeah, we could have had that done. Uh, sorry, at 2.30, we could have had that done by 3.30. Video on a couple of them. I don't know which. Did you have one on live too? Yeah, I had Sweet. live 360 and the the regular camera jig. Awesome. 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 So you want this? That's not better. I appreciate it. But um. I really do. Uh, if I owe you, if I, right yeah, what if I, whatever I owe you, like if you need more, just let me. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Scroll up. I'll be right back, sir. Uh, 
Oh. Yeah, but it's... I'm, I know, I know, I know, but I just don't want people thinking... Yeah, yeah, that I'm doing some crazy shit. I got you. My fucking allergies are just... I don't even know what the fuck. Oh, man. But, uh, yeah, I'll text you in just a little bit. That's my address. Ask you what my dad wants to do about breakfast. And then we're going to be uh, getting everything ready. Well, actually, we'll be on our way, pretty much. Um, anybody's welcome. Okay. And... It'll probably just be me, because he, he said yes. Yeah, while you're getting everything together, here you go. Uh-oh. Just go inside your car, though. Okay. Yeah.